Hello again there, YouTube fans. This is the Real Creepy Doll Man here. I'm back with an all-new episode. It is June the 26th of 2023. Time is now 3.39 p.m. Today's topic are on these 31 dolls. Okay, 716. Number 717. Number 700. In 18, number 719, number 720, number 721, number 722, number 723, number 724, number 725, number 726, number 727, number 728, number 729, number 700. And thirty, number seven hundred and thirty one, number seven hundred and thirty two, number seven hundred and thirty three, number seven hundred and thirty four, number seven hundred and thirty five, number seven hundred and thirty six, number seven hundred and thirty seven, number seven hundred and thirty eight, number seven hundred and thirty nine, number seven hundred and forty, number seven hundred and forty one. Number 742, number 743, number 744, number 745, and number 746. Now, all YouTube fans and all you Dow Real Creepy Doll Man fans from around the world would like to know, are they all cursed, haunted, or possessed? Nobody truly knows, not including the Real Creepy Doll Man himself knows. The only way to sell this is do it the old-fashioned way, is doing and communicating with our spirit friends for 13 and beyond. And like I said before in the past, since the real Creepy Ghost Hunter Jr. has retired, I'll have to team up with somebody new to continue on with communicating with our spirit friends from part 13 where we should have left off first and had to do it now backwards after we finish part 14 of part 2 first and then continue on. But let me go around the room and show you what I have. And uh, we'll explain. I have seven dolls from my sister's last collection of her Barbie dolls and with mine. And I'll point them out right now as I go around. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. And this is the last one of my sister's original collection of my younger sister's dolls. These are all what's left of her Barbie dolls. Now, I did go out and buy a few new dolls to add to this collection. And I bought them at the thrift store. And I'll show you those before we get into the other ones. They're actually, I bought only three at the thr thrift store. And I'll show you them first. And um, I'll get to show you those right now. And the one in the far back that's dressed like uh, Snow White. But it's a knockoff doll. And then I got this one. I didn't get her from uh, a thrift store. I got her from another store. That's sort of like a secondhand store that sells them like a thrift store. But I'm not going to say what it is. But they sell all kinds of other stuff in there too for children. And I bought her there on this doll. This is an uptown girl from a... Uh, OMG doll from the uh, little, I mean, for the LL series. And then I bought this one brand new, and this is actually Spice Babe. And I had to have her, so I got her from the LL series for the OMG dolls. Now, the rest of the dolls were given to me by my niece, my younger niece. She bought them to me. They were donated by somebody that she probably didn't know. And as you know, I have two more Anna and Elsa dolls in this collection that that was in this collection I didn't know but uh I do have three Mel dolls now two of these are actually from Hannah Montana uh I think his name is Oliver I got the Oliver doll and then I got Hannah Montana with her hair cut short if somebody made her hair cut and gave her a haircut to look more like Myra Cyrus instead of making her look like uh you know Hannah Montana and I think, I swear to this, I don't think this is a Barbie doll. But I think it's a Britney Spears doll, but I can't really tell. I definitely know it's not a Barbie. And if you look at her face carefully, 
and if I put her down and get a close shot of it, I think she looks more like Britney Spears than she looks like Barbie. And I think it might be a Britney Spears doll, but I'm not for sure. But other than that, you know, it's hard to say. And then I have other Barbie dolls here that's different. And I have one Asian doll that stands out the whole crowd here because there's only one of her. I got two African-American dolls here. And I have a couple rare dolls here that's totally different from the rest of them. I have a Mycenes Barbie doll. And versus I have a much bigger Barbie doll. This is a 18-inch super-sized Barbie doll. Now, I like what they've done to her face. I kept it like that. I love the, the little heart shapes they draw on their face. I kept it like that. I might do a... Uh, cheerleading outfit for her and keep it sort of like that i i like that kind of detail how they've done the face i'm not going to change the look so i'm going to leave it just as it is now all these were donated by my niece she got them from another person some girl down her street from in the area where she lives gave them to her and she was about ready to get rid of them anyway so she donated them and uh, she was about ready to throw them away. So she donated them to my niece. And then she gave them to me. So I got lucky. And I got a much bigger collection than what I needed to get. So that just happens for the best of us. And uh, I'm going to say this to all the fans. Keep watching more to come. Because there will be more new episodes. What will they be? Watch and find out. This is a real creepy doll man saying all the fans out there. Goodbye. And God bless you all.